today I am coming on really, really quickly, and I'm not saying that all the time, but um, we have a doctor's appointment for Aubrey in about um, an hour, so we have to head out the door in the next 20 minutes or so. But um, today I wanted to come on to introduce you guys to Aubrey. I know I have been like posting little pictures of like her feet and her head and things like that and I haven't really actually posted a picture of the baby but we wanted all of our friends and family to see her first before we started putting any pictures on the internet or anything like that and um, everybody has actually gotten a chance to see her at least um, if not in person they have actually gotten a chance to see a picture of her or something so now we're a little more comfortable um, actually showing you guys the baby and introducing you to her. We have a, a very small window of time where she's actually awake because normally she just eats and she goes right back to sleep. And um, But right now she's up because I just got her um, sort of ready. Well, I'm getting her ready. I got a little socks I gotta put on. But um, so she's up and you get to see her with her eyes open right now. But we're going to the doctor, baby girl is a month old and we go to the doctor um, weekly just to get a weight check on her because when, when they sent her home she was three pounds about four ounces and um, she's been home now two weeks and when we went to the doctor last Friday excuse me I'm putting on her socks but when we went to the doctor last Friday she was still not four pounds yet so I'm hoping when we go today that she will actually <laughs> have crossed the four pound mark but when we went to the doctor last week friday and today is um tuesday um april 2nd and today's my mother-in-law's birthday so happy birthday mom um but yeah we are um we have to call mom and to wish her happy birthday we haven't done that yet but um when we went to the doctor on friday she was three pounds and 14 ounces so anyways before she starts to get a little too antsy and while I have her sitting down, I don't know if I'm gonna have to turn the, I might have to turn the light off if it's too bright for her. But, little Miss Ma'am is up. That light is probably, okay. See, that's better, mommy. So, here we go. That is, <laughs> so here you go. Here is Miss Aubrey Sana. and She's, any, she's somewhere between three pounds, 15 ounces, and maybe four pounds and four ounces or something like that. I don't know, we're gonna see when we go to the doctor today. But um, all of her clothes right now are preemie clothes because she can't not, she cannot fit newborn clothes right now. Hey, mommy. Hey. Hey, Nika. But um, she cannot fit any newborn clothes and as you can see, this is a preemie um, jacket that we've actually washed a couple times because we tried to make it a little smaller. Because even the preemie clothes that we got for her was a little big and um, whatnot. So let's see. So yes, mommy and baby are doing well. She's about to go to sleep, I can tell. So tell you two bye-bye. You just refuse to look at that camera. You refuse. Tell YouTube bye bye. Say bye bye YouTube. Bye bye YouTube. Uh oh, you gotta spit up. I don't know. Anyway, so tell YouTube bye bye. There you go. Bye bye YouTube. <laughs> so yeah, I wanted to introduce you guys to Aubrey, um, and. I will also post a few pictures that we've taken along the way with a couple of captions because um, one thing I wanted to share with you guys, one picture in particular, and I'll probably insert it here, but um, I don't know if you guys have heard of any old folk tales or just anything suspicious, like any kind of um, myth or anything, but like I know she has the hiccups often and um, my mother-in-law and my mother and I've, I've heard this before when I was younger because I'm sure they've done it with me um, but they say to put a brown paper bag like you're supposed to wet a brown paper bag and stick it on the baby's forehead and that's supposed to get rid of the hiccups and then someone else is telling me that they heard about um, taking a straw out of a broom and then like sticking it in the baby's hair and that's supposed to stop the hiccups and there are like tons and tons of old myths and things that people do 
um, for hiccups and just like all kinds of stuff for babies. So that was one of them. And my mother was over here and my mother-in-law was over here the same day. And she had the hiccups and of course, you know, my mom had been saying about this brown paper bag for a while. So I was like, you know what, bring the paper bag. So she brought it and um, we had the brown paper bag on her head and it was hilarious. Like I had to get some pictures of that. So um, yeah, she was just sitting with the brown paper bag on her head. And everybody's like, well, did it work? And I think my thing is, I, I told people, I was like, yeah, it did work. But when you think about it, like even if she didn't have the brown paper bag on her head, the hiccups would have eventually stopped anyway. So I can't say that it worked because of that, but her hiccups definitely did stop. So. Uh, but yeah, she's doing well. She's growing at a great pace. Um, she has been eating um, every three to four hours. Um, and now her appetite is kind of increasing a little more. She came home and she was eating about maybe 40 milliliters of um, breast milk because I've been pumping for her and we, we breastfeed every now and again. But she's been having about 40 milliliters when she came home. And that was maybe about an ounce, a little over an ounce and a half or so. But now she's up to 60 milliliters, which is actually um, two ounces. So she's taking two ounces. It was every four hours, but now it seems like she's getting hungrier faster. So she's taking two ounces like maybe every three, every three hours. Um, she sleeps well, she sleeps throughout the day, she sleeps throughout the night. Now she's starting to like stay up a little bit more and we are catching more times that she actually has her eyes open and she's more alert and everything. But through the night, she's um, the only time she really gets up is, is if she needs a diaper change and um, or if she needs to eat, of course, and then she'll pretty much go right back to sleep. So um, it's been a joy since she's been here and I've just been, you know, really, really excited about being a new mommy, and um, my husband has been really, really excited. He's been very, very helpful. I know um, he's gone back to work, of course. He did take some time off with us, but it's been a, a bit of a struggle for him because he's been working early hours and long nights, uh, long days, and, you know, coming home and still helping me with her. So, um, but yeah, he's at work right now, and um, we get to sit home and chill out for a bit. I don't know um, if or when I'm going to work because she's so tiny and my husband really does not want to put her in daycare or you know we haven't really decided on who's going to be taking care of her or if we're going to get a nanny or whatever we're going to do. So for right now we're just in chill mode and it's just her and mommy right now. We're just chilling at home but um, let's see I'm trying to think of anything else. I can't really think of anything right now, um, but I'm gonna go to the doctor and if I think of anything else when we get back, then I'll come back on and record, okay? I will be back on with um, another follow-up video with her. And the older that she gets, you know, of course, you you definitely see her more in videos, but um, yeah, I just wanted to introduce you guys to her today. Now I need to go ahead and feed her and get her ready and situate in her car seat and everything. So I will talk to you guys soon. Please let me know if you have any questions um, about preemie babies or you know taking care of baby this small anything whatsoever if you have any kind of questions go ahead and leave them below and I will talk to you guys soon all right bye say bye 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 YouTube say bye bye YouTube she's like get that bright light out of my face <laughs>